FNN. Headline News Update. Good morning, folks. Uh, this is Steve Rhodes coming to you live from the shores of sunny Delray Beach, Florida. This is your 11 a.m. update, and currently all the U.S. indices that we track are trading to the downside. The same is with each of the sectors with inside the S&P 500. The Dow's up 235 points. That's about seven-tenths of a percent to the downside. Nine-tenths for the S&P are 35 points. Seven-tenths for the NASDAQ, 186 points there. And the Russell off about one, a little over one percent. That's 21 points to the downside. Semi's off one and three-tenths, or 37 points. Gold is off nine bucks. Silver's down 39 cents. Light sweet crude is off 67 pennies. Natural gas back 17 cents and the u.s dollar is up eight pennies trading out at 106 even steven let's go take a look at our nine panel market update chart we begin with the es mini in the upper left hand side you'll see a new profile that is attempting to form attempting to form because we're using stevie's advanced doppler tool out there those will not be confirmed until this evening but you and i do know where sellers and buyers are located the sellers are at the top of that profile and that's in the range of 4035. I say in the range because the center of that profile is much closer to the top than the bottom. And therefore, that's a bearish structured profile. Should it complete at day's end, and should we see a close below 39.94, that would then suggest run back to support, that support level being 39.39. We do see that the spot volatilics index did gap up, but it's still below its 50-day exponential moving average. So still a bullish signal for the S&P 500. The NQ out here? Trading right at uh, what well, well, really just consolidating with inside its daily profile. It's a tight range, 11,571 to 11,981. It's been doing it for two, four, six, eight sessions now. If we take a look at that US dollar index, it still has its buy the D point pattern. That was confirmed out here with the bullish hammer candle back on November 15th. This too has a new profile support, 105.78, resistance, 106.48 there. Goldilocks has pulled back to test its level of support, the bottom of its daily profile. That's at the area of 1741.90, today's low 1742.30. Silver is consolidated with inside its daily profile, though it is forming a new weekly profile. That resistance level then in silver is between 2208 2194. If you take a look at light speed crude, it is trading below a prior, well, I take that back. It is um, testing its buy the D point pattern that formed on November 21st. The price did close below 75.27, but I actually know there's a TD9 count out here. So the real level to be watching, in order for lights we crude to suggest much lower price would be a close below 74.98. Natural gas completes a sell the D point pattern. Brand new profile forming here. Support down at 633. Stay tuned for the Trader Z Show. But if you have to start your Monday, please have a magnificent one. Thanks for joining us. We'll look forward to seeing you again soon. Take care.